Hi, welcome to another video here at AI Code King. Ever since Devon came into existence, there have been multiple open source alternatives popping up everywhere. But today, we have a new contender, and that is Codal. If we look at their GitHub page, they state that Codal is a fully autonomous AI agent capable of performing complicated tasks and projects using the terminal browser, and editor. I must say, the GitHub page of Codal is extremely short. It does not include any useful data about Codal. It also lacks a proper installation guide, but at least they have a Discord server from where you can chat and get some help if you get stuck somewhere. Moving on, we can see that it only supports OpenAI models, which means you can't use it with Gemini, Claude, or open source LLMs like DBRX that I made a video about. Among all the Devon alternatives I have seen, it falls under the bad section due to its lack of features. You can install it only with Docker, which I find really frustrating. I mean, they are only providing a UI above the OpenAI API. So why can't they create a setup guide for simple Linux Windows installation. It really frustrates me. They should also add a Google Colab option so that it is more accessible for people. I'm sorry, Python nerds, but this project is made with Golang, Node.js, Docker, and PostgreSQL. Anyway, the part that makes it better than any other alternative is its UI. It looks so cool. Every other alternative has an extremely bad UI, which makes it hard to concentrate. But I must say, this looks amazing. On the left, you have the tasks history, threads. In the middle, you have the chat window. And on the right, you have a tab-based interface that includes terminal, browser, and code. That's going to be available soon. The developers here have shared a video of Codal updating its own dependencies, which is pretty amazing. It does it within minutes, and overall looks pretty cool. This is a very early alternative to Devon, and I must say it's starting to look good on some parts, while some parts are still lacking. But as people start contributing to it, I think it will grow to be a top contender. I can't wait for it to catch up with Devon and eventually beat it. This alternative gets a thumbs up from me. But if you liked my video, give it a thumbs up as well by liking, commenting, and subscribing to this channel. Bye.